Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In Excel, when you get past the end of a printable page as defined by your current page setup, Excel will insert an automatic page break. Sometimes these automatic page breaks occur in places where you would rather not have them occur. They may leave data on a second page orphaned from the rest of the worksheet. Maybe they leave the titles of columns on one page while the supporting data appears on the next page. Either way, in Excel you can adjust the page breaks so that all of the data that you want will be scaled to fit on a single printable sheet. To change where the page breaks occur in a worksheet, you can use the Page Break Preview. To get there, you can click the Page Break Preview button that appears in the Workbook Views group on the View tab within the ribbon. This will display your worksheet in the Page Break Preview, showing you the page breaks in your worksheet. Page breaks are represented in this view by dashed blue lines. Click and drag the dashed blue lines that represent your page breaks and drop them in the location where you want the page to break. Make sure that the breaks are where you want them to be located, and then click the Normal button in the Workbook Views button group on the View tab in the ribbon to return to the normal view of your workbook. Note that once you have inspected the page breaks in your document using the Page Break Preview window, you will then see them in the normal view of your worksheet as dashed black lines. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.